Turn out the light, the party's over. They say that all good things must end. Call it a night, the party's over. Da 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 dee. Yeah, I know. You're probably wondering, what the heck was that? That's Dandy Don Meredith, man. Turn out the lights, the party's over. Now, if you're younger, you don't remember that. But if you're older, you remember that from Monday Night Football. Why am I singing that song? Because it's the last week. The party's over. How's your commitment? Now, I've been checking in with some of you, and I'll check in the, with the rest of you today and tomorrow and Wednesday just to see how you're doing on your commitment. Because we all said if everybody made a commitment and fulfilled it over the 30 days, then good things would happen. Now, we've posted new information on Catalyst for Responsibility on systems thinking and agent of change. This web page will be up forever. And so you can come back to this page and utilize the information over and over again. I appreciate those of you that have emailed me notes and thanked me for doing this. You're welcome. We do it because you're important. We do it because you touch every citizen from cradle to grave. There's an old poem that goes like this. Not what did he gain but what did he give? Not how did he die, but how did he live? These are the yardsticks to measure the worth of a man as a man, regardless of birth. Most people, when they go and choose a vocation, they don't have an opportunity to literally alter the outcome of history, but you do. Oh no, maybe not the whole world's history, but your little corner. Every time you put time and energy into a child, or when you build out those senior programs, or when you maintain the park or the facility, or when you offer that special event, yes, in each one of those occasions, you can make a significant impact in somebody's life, and maybe, in some small way, alter the outcome of history. Yes, you have an opportunity to live in such a way and to give in such a way that people would remember your name, not because of the wealth that you accumulated, not because of the, the battles that you've won, but because of the difference that you made. That's the profession that you're in. On behalf of the three million plus people in the state of Nevada, my wife and I and our family thank you. Thank you for your early mornings and your late nights. Thank you for your weekends and your holidays. Thank you for all the times that you took away from your own family for the betterment of community. That's noble and honorable work, and we thank you for it. But be clear, I'm not just thanking you for what you will have done, what you have done. I'm thanking you for what you will do. The new pro programs, the new initiatives, the difference that you make in the future, the problems that you solve for our seniors and our kids, protecting our open space, and ensuring that Nevada stands as a beacon to others of what can be done when the, when the recreation, parks, arts, culture, and heritage, the quality of life sector aligns. Great things can happen. It's been fun hanging out with you for the month. Check out the new stuff. If we can ever be of any help, you let us know. Thank you again for all your hard work. Take care, everybody. Turn out the lights. The party's over. <laughs> they say that all good things must end.